Hi fellow Ipsters, you're here with Giga Kathy. I've never been to my channel. Please consider unsubscribing. I do the spoiler videos for subscription boxes like Boxy Charm and Ipsy and others. Are we ready for the spoilers? So the first spoiler is going to be the glam bag. As you can see, the color is so springy. Um, I love it. I like the combination you know, like a sunrise and it's really pretty. The items that's going to be in it for the glam bag are nail polish. It's going to be from Nails Incorporation. You can see they're a lilac grove. Primrose Walk or Camellia Drive. Interesting. It looks like it's a more pinkish uh, purple <laughs> type of colors that's in it. It's also an actual size, so that's pretty amazing. Um, the second one will be from Estate Cosmetics. It's the Doomy Highlighter in By. It looks like it's a little champagne or a, a really really light tan this is a deluxe sample the third one is from gold Faden md it's a wake up call overnight regener regenerative facial treatment so this is like a another kind of like a moisturizer type of thing it's probably a cream that's exactly what it is so it's a night cream and it's supposed to hydrate our skin while basically sleeping um, the fourth one is a concealer from Yensa Skin on Skin. Um, it's gonna be five colors. Uh, it's gonna be a fair, cool, a fair, cool, light neutral, medium warm, tan neutral, or deep warm. So lastly, will be we're gonna get a brush, which is from Farah. This is a large blender. Oof, I can tell you, I have a lot of fire brushes and they're really amazing. I actually have one close to me. And the style, you know, I've I've cleaned this like a lot of times already, and it's it's really sturdy. And when it well, this one is really, really compact, but it's it's very nice you know it's not like one of those that has the, the bristles are like sometimes pokey but yeah like a sturdy pokey that's actually one of my favorite brands from that the ipsy usually gives those are the five items that i have for you guys for as a spoilers for glam bags and the next one is actually the glam bag plus it's a shake clutch which is it's a blue it's a really good colors it reminds me of um, really nice weather blue skies and, and all that <laughs> it's very springy as well so this one i have like eight items eight products that's gonna be in it so i have a feeling this is gonna be a lot of variations because i think it's this one is a five to seven products and we're gonna see a lot more the first two items that i will tell you is from the same brand it's kate somerville so i'm thinking this is probably one of those variations just because they're in the same brands and um one of them is actually a serum and the other one is a hydration gel this one is kate somerville kx active concentrate ceramides plus omegas serum it does improve the appearance of skin tone evenness that's nice Ooh. this is supposed to soothe and restore serum the second one is a hydration gel um this is the kate somerville wrinkle warrior hydration gel so this one has hyaluronic did moisturizer Ooh, i love moisturizers so that's just made me excited especially this is a gel i like gel more than um a cream because cream sometimes tends to be like a lot heavy on my skin and i kind of don't like that feeling on my skin the third one is from murad it's a renewing eye cream Ooh, eye creams 
<laughs> it sounded like ice cream <laughs> of ice cream because I do have some wrinkle under eye now your girl is not young now I need I need more of a moisturizing because my skin is really dry now this one retails for $82 and it's supposed to be very delicate for your eyes and it will help firm with firmness it will brighten the skin and then it also hydrates and minimize the signs of aging at the delicate eye area so that's nice i want that the uh, next one is from nomad cosmetics it's a nomad sydney there's kiss of sun palette retails for 27 dollars and it is the bronzer and contour powder fifth one our brush set this is a from MOTD I got five piece brush set so this is all for for the eyes um, I don't remember if I have an MOTD brush but and this looks interesting I want that on my glam bag plus <laughs> <laughs> and next one is from Galactic's King Glow Duo in Sunset and Moonlight. So this retails for I think $26. It looks very nice. Um I'm not too sure. Let's see if this is actually a cream or a powder. The cream formula. Uh, it's supposed to be a long wearing and doesn't dry and there's no cakiness on using this. It's not cakey. We like that. It's long wearing. I'm excited to try this one. Day Riley. This time we're gonna get um, a lac uh, all in one lactic acid treatment. This is supposed to deeply exfoliate the dull surfaces of the skin for clarity and younger looking skin. People instantly plumps the look of fine lines and wrinkles in three minutes. Ooh. When I hear something about wrinkles, I'm just like. I need that in my life, even though I don't know if that works. <laughs> There's another one, um, Super Goop Shimmer Shade Illuminating Cream Eyeshadow. It has an SPF 30 in Golden Hour. Wow. I don't think I've, I have any eyeshadows that has SPF. This is crazy. <laughs> Something we can wear this coming, you know, summer. It's a cream eyeshadow, so it kind of makes sense that it has a little bit of well not that's not a little bit that's a good amount of sunscreen okay let's move on the last is the glam bag ultimate so for that one it's really pretty i really like the color for this one it's kind of reminds me of um, um the tequila sunrise <laughs> i'm thinking about drinks right now first one okay so the glam bag ultimate I don't know what they've been doing. Ipsy has been picking so good items for the Glam Bag Ultimate. They've been up and up their game. This one, I feel like Ipsy kind of copied that for the coming May. Because Boxy Charm for this April had three palettes, a three variation of palettes for premium box. Let's start with this one first one is there's a palette I'm I'm thinking all this eyeshadow palettes might be um, a variation well I do have seven items in here so there's a big chance that there might be two palettes inside your back so why not right I don't know I don't know I'm not sure but what if you know that that's gonna be nice like I Will be thrilled anyway so first one is from dominic cosmetics the rustic glam palette this the colors of this palette is really nice i can make a good look out of this i've i have a palette but i haven't really played with it i kind of swatch some so i know it's it's good payment the second one is from Smashbox, the Cover Shot Eye Palette in a Blaze. So this one is a more neutral. So that's that's actually good. It can fit anybody. 
right it looks like it also have highlighters in it not too sure about that third one is from laura jeller is that how you say that <laughs> anyways it's urban garden palette in central park that's really pretty i think there's a highlighter a blush and four eyeshadows i believe but even the eyeshadow there's like a brown one dark brown looks like you can use that as a contour try out those eyeshadows and use it as something else anyways um that looks like a pretty palette too see didn't i tell you there's three palettes in there and then the boxy charm also has three palettes but theirs is april and mcs has it for may hmm interesting huh okay there's one from dermis dermis their medicine Wayless face moisturizer it has an spf 25 Ooh, i think they're kind of the, the items that's coming up are with a you know with spf because it's almost summer so we all need that sunscreen this is a daily face moisturizer it has green tea and vitamin e and sage leaf sage leaf and grape stem cells Ooh. That sounds nice i do like i do like um an spf on my moisturizer during summertime just because it it really helps with keeping our skin especially now that i'm aging i need that hydration on my face it's protection from the sun um the fifth one is from Sun sunday riley ceo c plus e micro dissolve cleansing oil so this is a gentle but thorough that dissolves and rinses away makeup debris or micro pollution i don't know i'm not too excited with cleansing oils like i said oils is a uh, mm, last on my list um, my, my skin is so dry which i think i should use the oil better because it will hydrate my skin more but i just don't like the feeling of the oil it's i just don't like i just don't like it when it's greasy we're gonna get a hairbrush <laughs> it's from foxy bay it's a wet hairbrush interesting i'm not interested <laughs> but we are gonna get a hairbrush um the seventh one is actually from i don't know how to say this is it i'll make maquillage I don't know but it's so hard to, <laughs> to read that this is actually a waterproof lip liner in vintage so it looks like a nude pink it looks nice I don't know how good this is but I like waterproof lip liners I don't really use a lot of lip liner I use them sometimes but not when I'm recording anyways that's everything I have for you guys today um, if let me know in the comment section if you like how i did this video if you like the one i used to do where i actually you know just do a voice over the pictures and tell you more about the, the products or did you like how i did it this time just need more you know I just probably need more information for you guys but let me know in the comment section how you like it so i can edit it the way it's easier for you to watch um and to see the items as well i hope to see you in my next video and my next spoiler maybe it's not ipsy or boxy charm if this is something that you like to see and watch um please just consider in subscribing i'm uploading every week when it comes to spoilers, I can't really tell when I do upload because I do my research first and gra and gather more spoilers and then make a video rather than doing a few items here and there. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And that's it for me today. Thank you so much for watching. Salamat. Babush.